Welcome to Kansas! Speedway for the Season 2 Discount Tire Cup Series Race 6. Held at Kansas Motor Speedway in downtown Kansas. Kansas City, no one really cares. Dale Earnhardt and his famous number 3 Goodwin service car will be the pace car driven by Dale Earnhardt Jr. Chase Elliott's Corsair Ace Pole for the Bushy McBush Race 200. We have a 47 car field today. I don't know how because I remember it from 43, and I think we have the same amount. I think we have the same exact number of cars, like the same kind of cars, but apparently not. Alright, so without further ado, let's get right into the race. But first, drivers to watch for. Chase Elliott scored today's poll after a random draw, and then 2021 Napa Chevrolet. Joey Logano in his Shell Penzoil 4 Mustang. A new die cast that we just got a couple days ago, hoping to get that new 2021 Shell Penzoil 4 Mustang to victory lane. Martin Truex Jr., Danny Hamlin, and Kyle Busch are always good at Kansas. The three Joe Gibbs trio trying to maybe get the same exact order as they are right now in the order of one, two, three. But actually, they want to be first, second, third, whichever order they please. Three more drivers to do. Brad Keselowski in the two car. 2021 Discount Tire Ford Mustang looking to have a great day tier today at Kansas. Second to last is Ty Dillon. He qualified really bad after a random draw, but not really bad, but he qualified bad, but let's see how he can do in the rest of the race. And the final driver is Ross Chat. I'm just kidding. Rich Sanos Jr. Rich Sanos Jr. He's going to be pretty decent today. I believe he's saying hello in the Dex Image 2021 for my saying. But Rick Stenhouse Jr. are going to have a good day, hopefully, to get a win. And now we don't have a YouTuber to say the command, but we do have we do have Rockstar Freddy to say the command. Drivers, start your engines! Let's go, Kevin Harvick. Okay. Uh, so, without further ado, let's get your starting lineup. Presented by Mobile One. Of Sports Pro Cation and the 48 of Gavin Brown. Row 2 and the 22 car, we have RC Studios and the 93 of Tracy. In row number 3, we have the 23 of NASCAR, Stop Motion, and more, and the 88 car of NASCAR Bros. Row 4 has the 4 car of, um, of ADCS Racing and the 10 car of URL Cup Series. Then we have the 17 of Luck Ghostly and the 19 of CT CST31 Racing Network. Row number 6, we have the 5 car of Ty Triplet and the 11 car of URL Cup Series. Row 7, we have the 3 of Junior's Channel and the 8 car of Sports Pro Cason. Next we have the 25 of D and the 18 of Rowdy 18 Bush. Next we have the 1 of Cool Cup Series and the 24 of Luigi Plush Productions. Next we have in the 20 Oh, yeah, in the 20, we have G 
Junior's channel. And the 62 of the 62 of Keelan Harvick. Next we have the 41 car of Rowdy 18 Bush. And the 2 of Ty Triplett. Next we have the 12 car of Marcrio Parada and the 40 of Brandon Gomez. Next we have the 21 of Good Ranks Cup Series and the 7 of the one and only CST31 Racing Network. And then we have the Team 8, the 54 of Tyler and the 81 of Bryson. Next row we have the 37 of the, and the 43. 37 and the 43 NASCAR Shop Racing and War and the 43 of Series Cup Series. Next we have the 14 of Brandon Gomez and the 32 of NASCAR Lego Cup Series. Next we have the 49 of Derek and the 38 car of the Gold Kid 33. Next we have we have the 96 of the Wiggy Bush Production. Actually, no, that's the 99. The 96 of BSP Gaming and the 77 of Justin Haley. Next, we have the sixth of the Rocket Man, Mr. Fox, uh, BSP Gaming, and the 33 of Luck Ghostly. Next, we have the 60 car of Garrett Smithley and the double zero of Siri Cup Series. Next, we have the 99 of Luigi Pus Productions and the 47 of Cool Cup Series, the winner of last race. We have the 31 of Chase Diamond and the 42 of Thomas Apple. In the next row, we have the 34 of Thomas Apple and the 78 of Chase Diamond. And then rounding up today's field is the 15 car of James Davidson. So here we go. Green flags in the air and just. Green flags in the air here in Kansas. <laughs> Lap two now. Oh, Joey, oh, Ryan Blaney's in the wall. Here comes, and they're, they're big and banging. They're crisscross, and Joey Logano to the lead still. Here comes Elliot now on the inside, trying to take the lead away. Oh, around goes Kurt Busch, but he saved it. Cole Custer lives. Oh, around goes Kyle Busch, he's in the fire, back to the Larson. And he goes up in the air to Custer. Big crash. And Redick piled in late. See him down at the bottom of your screen. What even happened here? Kyle Busch, Cole Custer. Kyle Larson. It's lap three, and we have to have caution. Kyle Bush. It looked like he just got loose, or maybe got turned by Kyle Larson. I'm not too sure, but Kyle Larson turned him. But he was okay in the wreck. Uh, he might be able to continue. I doubt it. But let's look at the replay here. That Kyle Larson just turned Kyle Busch into Byron. Back up into him. Uh, Larson who turned him and back down into Custer. Yeah, I mean, just Kyle Busch just all of a sudden just got turned. By William Byron, if you hear use, uh, sound effects in the back, it's a hair dryer for my, I don't know, from someone. Alright, Kyle Busch just got, and he got Larson back into Custer, big time crash. Caution is out. Big wreck. It's a five car wreck. You see, Hart, Keelan Harvick, I think, turned him. Alright, never mind, green flag's back out in the air. Oh, Kelly Legato spins! He goes right around, he does a 360, but gets back going. Chase Elliott to the lead. He's got Jimmy Johnson right behind him. Oh, Brett, uh, Derek gets it to Keselowski. Jones is on his side. Clint Boyer's upside down, and the big one happens in Kansas. Oh 
my gosh! Tim McMurray got turned by Priest, got into Derek, and then got into Keslowski. Oh my gosh. Huge, huge wreck. Goodness, did you see that? Yeah, he turned Keslowski and then got in. He turned right in to uh Kurt Bush spun and then they just started getting Did you see Clint Boy? He went upside down on his if you, if you look very closely down him when oh Michael McDowell's car is on fire. Uh from the contact with Clint Boyer going tipping him up and over, but if you look at Clint Boyer on the roof you can see the damage and on the left side the damage as well. Goodness. I think Ricky Stenhouse, yeah, you can see Ryan Blaney, Ty Dillon, and Ricky Stenhouse got caught in it. They got butt hit. And you see Blaney had to slow down because McMurray crashed right in front of him. Ty Dillon slammed into him, and then here came Stenhouse to slam into him. Eric Jones, did y'all see that? Matt Benedetto was on his way to wrecking, but he saved it. But then Eric Jones did not, and did you see Eric Jones nearly flipped? Now, if you if you watch this not the premiere, if you don't watch this on the premiere, and after the premiere, oh, Kislowski, look at Kislowski, oh, the 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 nose of that car just came off, and Justin Haley getting repairs. Look at the replay. Oh, uh, yeah, look at Eric Jones. That's the picture I want to stay on for my mind. And then Clint Boyer just started tumbling. Uh, yeah. I got tipped over back by Trump. Yeah, the 37 turned the 40, who turned the 49, who turned the 2, who turned the 1, who turned... Hey, yeah, Eric Jones is flipping. I thought he was going to flip. Like, it could have turned out like the Ryan Priest crash back in 2020. But then you see that 14 car just start tumbling down the front the back straight away. This is just a normal site at Talladega, which we're going to next next race, but Kansas? Do you really see a crash like this? Goodness gracious. Well, we're going to restart. Green flag back on the air. Let's get some crank it up from the Discount Tire Cup Series. So one lap of crank it up. Here comes Eric Everall around those Donald Trump. He spins through three and four. And the caution comes out. Made some contact with the 38 car of Anthony Alfredo. And just did a 360 spin. Looked exactly like Joey Logano. Let's look at the replay here. Oh, he just got underneath the 38 of Anthony Alfredo and just spun. Oh, imagine a contact with Daniel Suarez, it looked like. Just a little contact with Daniel Suarez. Let's so look. Did he get caught? No. He did, that car just spun on his own. Alright, green fell back on the air. Two laps to go. It's overtime. Two laps, three wide. Here they come. Coming to the white flag this time by. White flags in the air for Martin Truex Jr. Can he get the lead? Here comes Chase Elliott. They're three and four for the final time. Chase Elliott is going to win at Kansas. Wow. And burns it down in Kansas. Motor Speedway. And there's your finishing results. Oh my goodness. I thought this race was going to be 25 minutes like the last one. Because the last race was 25 minutes. This is only like 15. Goodness gracious. Um, well, Chase Elliott wins the Bushy McBush race 200 at Kansas. And like I said earlier, the next race is going to be at Talladega. Get ready for Sweet Home Alabama music. Peace out. See you on the next one.